be such great pleasure to introduce everybody to Yvonne McNamara, who is joining us on stage for the very first time. She says she's a bit nervous, but I don't think she, I don't think it, it's going to show at all. Your eyelashes look beautiful, your dress is gorgeous, I'm sure your voice is every bit as beautiful. Um, in addition to sharing your musical talents, you also have an envelope in your, well, a makeshift envelope, she shared that with me too, but um, and what is in your envelope? $100. Oh, well, when you said it was the family, I thought it was going to be like 20 or 25 A hundred dollars? Is that from the family? Um, my dad just kind of put it together. Isn't that nice? Well, thank you, Dad McNair. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. So, um, can you just tell me a little bit about the song that you're singing and what the message is in it? It's called, I Want to Believe. What does, what's the message in it? Um, that you want to believe and you can believe in and I do believe that miracles can come true because we're making one right here on the empty stocking fund. We have had incredible donations, big and small, and I do want a preference that, um, you know, the later in the evening, the bigger the checks. But if you have a $20 donation, that is going to mean every bit as much to us at the empty stocking fund as the $50,000 donation. You heard the fuss that we made over the knitted things that we receive today, that means every bit as much, if not more, because I know a lot of heart and soul goes into that. So I just want to let you know how appreciative we are of your musical contributions. And I don't want to keep anybody in suspense, nor myself, so I'm going to take your check, I'm going to get out of your way and let you sing I Want to Believe. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Yvonne McNamara. <laughs>
I thank you for sharing your gift with us. <laughs> We're very, very touched by it. So thank you so much, and I do hope that you'll come back and join us again next year. <laughs> Good, great. Now over to you, Victoria. Talk about blowing the doors off of this place. <laughs> Thank you so much, and I can hear the phones ringing. Let's keep them ringing, 